us here give us parting ways with a loved one it's never that easy because we will definitely miss those beautiful moments we shared with the deceased when she was still alive welcome to gaza media my name is gilad your correspondent for gaza media today january 12 2023 we are out here at the kumba mutuary kumba general hospital mutuary where the mortal remains of late mama ankrika funke justin aung leke will be removed in a little while and conveyed directly to the St. Anthony's Catholic Church in Boyaro, Kumba, where the ritual mass is going to take place. Mama Ankreta died in Yaounde after a degenerated disease and leaves behind nine children, many family members, friends, and loved ones to mourn her. So please do stay connected to Gaza Media as I bring you footages of this funeral event. Thank you. Truly, this world is not our own. We are just passing through. The three days funeral program of late Mama Ankreta Fonke Justine Leke Awum, who rests in the Lord on the 14th of December 2022, started on Thursday, January 12, 2023, with the removal of the mortal remains from the Kumba General Hospital mortuary. At about 9 a.m., family members and sympathizers were already seated, waiting for the mortal remains to be removed. Thereafter, the mortal remains were transported to the St. Anthony's Catholic Church, Kumba, for the requiem mass. Mass that begins with procession with the casket to the altar, followed by animation by the choir. In his homily, the officiating priest urges all present to live a good life, knowing that someday we will also leave this world, as today is the turn of Mama Anqueta. This was followed by thanksgiving by the family and sympathizers. Moving on, the mortal remains were taken to the family compound in Boya Road, Kumba, for laying in state and viewing.
Then, food of various varieties were served on the food buffet. Oh, the grace Father, before meals was said, for the life of our mother, whom and sympathizers queued up to serve themselves. Next was animation from the World Family Meeting, followed by some musical performance. Moving on, the mortar remains were transported to Lewa in the BLM division, where the priest said the final blessings during the funeral mass. Your servant Justin, who has fallen asleep in Christ, may rejoice to rise again. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, ever and ever. Amen. Next was the barrier. Talking to Chief Funke, 
he expresses his regret losing Mama Ankreta because she supported the family greatly. So uh, I want to give you a brief statement concerning this my daughter, the wife of uh, Bao in the war. So uh, I inherited a drum. I came back from Nigeria in Sokoto. He, she was here in Kumba with the red brother, Bado uh, Iti Ikokobe. So Bado Iti Ikokobe is the pillar of Funke. Because all the children of Funke passed through the Bado Iti. So Aunt Kreta, this present Aunt Kreta, you know, my Aunt Justina will lie here instead. Also passed through Bado Iti. So as Bado Dina, he inherited the, the philosophy of Bado Iti Ikokobe. And she did that in the, this family to give advice to put people in the rightful direction when you are going contrary she advise you no matter you reason negatively but her own was to put you straight and uh, in terms of a uh, financial con con support she was doing at her, her own level because the husband was uh, at the finance department but she as a wife who had not no it was, she was not a civil servant, but her own contribution to the family was so great because uh, she wanted to project the philosophy of Funke Ekokobe, the father, who delivered her and handed her, gave her to the in law, her Dani Awu, who was uh, working in the Ministry of Finance by then in West Cameroon. So I'm very happy that we are here on this. To pay our last respect to Mami Awo, and Peter Funke, because what she has done to this family, I the successor, I can only talk what she has done to me. Because during this crisis, uh, my entire family, she inherited my entire family that they should come and to harbor them for so many years that they should come because she cannot be here like that with, with the crisis like that. So I'm so comfortable. I even of her. Been on that favor, I don't think that some people after part of the company died, I did not have people in the family to have the possibility to do that type of support to me. The president of Lewo meeting Kumba also says how they will miss her presence. Mami, be our member from long time. As uh, uh, I know, for many uh, years, Mami has been a member. Mami, since the enter meeting in, in our first cohort meeting, since he lived with the people for America, we be with Mami together in the Holy Spirit, as you know, because every contribution, everything we the past for meeting, Mami, they did one. Well. So, Mami, be a very serious member. So, the loss of Mami in our midst. It is very, very painful. Talking to her kids, they all expressed in what way they were going to miss Mama Anqueta. Yeah, what can I say? That was my mom. She used to call me Uncle Nick. I mean, my own mother calling me Uncle Nick. I mean, it tells it all that. We had that bond, we had that connection. We were friends, she was my friend. She was my, I don't know, it's like my, she was like my wife. We could talk about anything in life, from relationships, women, friends, she knew everything. One characteristic that she had was this, she was so loving. Yeah. I mean, she raised us up and had always encouraged us. I want she encouraged us to love one another. And we try as much as possible to be united. I mean, we are eight of us from her womb, and then we adopted this little guy to tell you how loving she was. She, she, she was. So what I'm, what I can say is, we always try to continue what where she left. Love, love, love. There's something interesting I also want you to know. 
Growing up as a young man, I never, never, never saw my dad. My name is uh, Chesida Aoun. Yeah, um, Mama's uh, daughter-in-law. They are married to Mama's son, Stephen. And uh, I would say Mama is my, was my friend. And uh, I don't know, the bathroom she left me. I'm Kemalas Stephen Omekoko Bain. I have a real relationship with Mami and Kweta Ajuti Omekoko Bain. So I'm the son, and I'm the father and husband. But people do not know, do not know the Bangwa culture. I'm the father because I'm named Mekoko Bain after his father. They always call me Papa. Why I'm the father because I, I'm the success of the family. So I'm named Kemale. I inherited this name from my father. So I'm the father. So I'm the husband, the father, and the son. So you can imagine the relationship we had. I think I had a very close relationship with her. We told me everything in her life. Any person that say goodbye, I know. Any person that say hello, I know. She was very a kind-hearted woman who fought for the future of his children. I remember when we used to write GC, she would be nervous more than us. She was always there for us. She helped me and encouraged me to get married, which I finally got married. To my beautiful wife, all thanks to her. She loved me so much that's when I asked myself, what do I do to share this love for my mother? And I love her so much. I'm going to miss her and I know she knows that. I'm happy to have told her that I love her. I dedicated my books to her, my published books, and I also named my second daughter Lekki. You can imagine the love I have for her. So we have a trip, trip in, in the twin love. Yeah. With three faces. Um, I'm very grateful for her. I want to thank her for her life. And thank all of you who came to support us and this house. On behalf of the family, we are very grateful. So now thank that she's no longer there, how do you intend to move the family forward from where she left it? Well, now that you are the success. I mean, supposed us to unify the family and work to help each other. Because we believe as a group we grow. If one person is successful, it's not important. I mean, if everybody is successful, that's the most important. We at Gaza Media express our condolences to the bereaved family. This is Gaza Media. For Community News, I am Gillette Atemkin.